Are we live? Yes, we are live. Welcome to Mason Evans' channel. I'm your host, Mason Evans, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Sword Isle of Armor DLC. Last time, we got our butts kicked a lot. And as I said, I would do after the stream, I would train up Cub Fu. And I did so by doing some max raid battles. Don't believe me? Yeah, uh, well, here we are. Kupu is now level 70. Into my boxes. Uh, that is where I put my party. These are all the Pokemon on I U caught. I caught this 59 Toxmix, this Colossal, the Salazzle. Espeon was one that I just wanted to catch for fun. Uh, Sizing Code. We already know about Lopany from the other episode. D Fracture and Doug Trio. I used some. Um, um uh, what what you might call the the experience candies. And now we're gonna get we're gonna finally after all two to three episodes of Isle of Armor, we're gonna kick this tower's butt. And now we're gonna save data again, so we won't forget. And now, we are gonna, gonna do this. We're gonna just do it and let our dreams be dreams. I also got rid of, of uh, Focus Punch and put back Brick Break. The only reason why, like I said, was because of that. You know Kapu can do it. Or give him a brick break to the head. How are you still alive, Psyduck? Iron Head. We took care of one. By the way, I uh, sold a lot of items to get. Yeah, off by two hit points. It's not gonna make a difference. Come on, Kapu, let's kick this guy's butt. Save data here. Blah, blah, blah. He sends out his Krabby. We're gonna give him a Brick Break again. To the third floor. Feel bad for the Meryl. I love Meryl. Four. 
fourth floor. This is the this is the one that's gonna be a pain in the butt. This is Poliwhirl. We're fighting a Poliwhirl here. He does protect, then he does his whirlpool. This is gonna be the one that's gonna be a. We're gonna do this. Heal him up. Yeah, we already know. I believe he's gonna go for a protect. If that's gonna be the case, we're gonna go use an aerial ace. And he went for whirlpool, surprisingly. Gonna go for protect. I know I, I knew that was gonna happen, so Okay Kapu now use your brick break again. There we go, we made 20,000 off of these people. Now we can finally head up to the final tower, part of this tower. And then maybe we'll do some more Dynamax raids, just for the fun, fun of it. We're gonna kick this guy's butt. There you are! I figured you'd choose the Tower of Waters, so I decided to wait you for wait for you here. Mansion Kupfu, you've both done well to get this far. Your final opponent is little old me. It's been a while since I the last time I fought like this, but I think you can handle it. A strange two players avoided by fish Pokemon. We'll all need some darkness in ourselves. Let me be the one to teach you the final lesson on the essence of water. I probably won't be able to catch up like this, so I'm gonna just speak. In, or not, I'm not gonna speak at all for this part. Maybe. Of course, he has his own kung fu. I will need to get shivers if I'm able to take you on. Hone your senses now, and this battle sharpen you. Show me how you can grow. Level 70 versus level 70. Should I get the speed? Watch closely. This is what Kapu's fish are truly capable of. And defeated. We defeated his Kung Fu. We are the champions. You young folks grow so fast. It never ceases to amaze me. I got 14,000 from him. Now, 
Evolve, my buddy. What a team. Impressive. Most impressive. <laughs> I knew you were worthy of my trust, Mason. You have done well. Very well indeed. In raising Kubu to this level of strength. Leon was once my best student a long time ago. He too attempted this trial. But he never made it to the tower at a tower. He got lost along the way. <laughs> now it is time to for Kupfu to evolve. And go show Kupfu the scroll of waters. Kupfu is ready now. Okay, Kupfu. You know what we have to do. We're gonna save the game and show him the way of the waters. The way of water for you, my boy. Yes, we want him to evolve. We got the airship -oo. The Wushu Pokemon. This is the Rapid st Strike style. Surging Strikes. Yeah, let's see what it is. What move is it? It's a water type. It results in a critical hit? In that case, we're getting rid of Endure. For her, you're very high. For you stands Urshifu. Sure to be on yielding armor that will shatter any blade and turn against it. And it has mastered the style of water. Bequa. It's almost sound it almost said be quiet, but it's a be quoi. Ha! You surely grown, haven't you? And to think not too long ago you would have run and hid behind me. Hey them I'm gonna I do not know. I forgot what I said. I would have run behind the old me. The moment we got hit. Yeah, there we go. Indeed. No matter how old I get, witnessing someone grow always brings joy to my heart. Mason, I was Shifu. Thank you both from the bottom of my heart. Oh, I almost forgot. I give this to anyone who has faced me when I was taking the battle seriously. I got his lead card. Let's go. Now, let's head back to the dojo. Urshifu is my buddy. Such time and strength. Perhaps the time has come. Maybe I need to get myself a Ditto and make another Urshifu. Let's go, Urshifu. Catch up to me. Huh? 
He arrives? Huh? What? What? Why did you? When did you? So many questions here. Oh, hey, welcome back, Mason. Looks like you've been hard at work, keeping up your training here at the dojo, eh? What are you doing here? That's what I'm asking you! Surprise! And nicely done, Mason. That's just the reason reaction I was just hoping for. I'm here on the island of Lynch Armor to research more about Dynamics phenomenon. So I- Sure, I hear! Now you two are French. How delightful! Hope you can't. Here was just asking my permission to camp out on the Iron of Arm. But where's the fun in mucking about in the mud? I was telling him he should stay here at the dojo. I mean, I mean it'd be loads easier than camping out for a long while. But when Dagino in the way? Everybody is welcome to wear out their welcome at the Master Dojo. Don't be shy, my boy. Besides, we're practically family already. You're the little brother of our Leon, after all. Yeah, but it's true. Lee did train here when he, he, we were both kids. All right then, M Master Mustard. You've twisted my arm. I hope you don't regret it, because I'm staying. Ooh, more to marry you. I'm pleased to punch, punch in a gold-plated head punch bowl. Which reminds me, Mason. I've got something I've been meaning to tell you about Kapu, or really its evolution, Urshifu. Okay. The truth is, the lovable rascal is capable of gigantic action too. But it's a bit tricky because it really can't stand the taste of Max Mushrooms. So Max Soup is off the menu unless you can make it more appealing to it. There's a certain something you can find here on the Isle of Armor though that will make even the Urshifu gobble up a bowl of Max Soup. And that's something something is. That certain something is. That certain something. It's actually. Come on, tell us. <laughs> Even I agree with Hop. The suspense is killing me. Is is killing me. Actually, I've forgotten what it is. Oopsie doopsie. Ah! <laughs> comedy, comedy fashion. Are you kidding me? No! <laughs> Even more fun to tease than your brother ever was. A certain something I'm thinking of is sure to make Max Soup more palatable to Urshifu. And it has something to do with another Pokemon. Now I think I'll get let the two of you figure out what it is. Give it a good think together. You're on your own, kiddo. The world is your cloister, so get cracking. Okay, we're gonna learn how to make Urshifu eat this stuff. Is this uh, how you, your training usually goes? I've really got no Rapidash in this race, but even I'm pretty curious about that certain something. I think I read something about Urshifu in a book once, too. It's the Wushu Pokemon, right? The book said it lives in the mountains, in some far-off region. Does it really? Huh? You didn't know. Don't you have one, Mason? Yeah. But yeah, I think I read that, read that Urshifu is absolutely mad for some kind of sticky honey. Mason! Honey is made of, from nectar of flowers and plants, right? So maybe we need a nectar made by some Pokemon, Pokemon that looks like flowers and plants. Comfy! It's comfy! And if we're looking into for those kinds of Pokemon, 
then I'd reckon there might be lots in the forest. I'll be able to look into Dynamaxing along the way, so cut me in for some exploration. There's a forest that, that big in marshland, right? Bet I can still beat you there. I bet it's a comfy. It's a flower. It's a poke it's a flower Pokemon. Sort of. Urshifu, we're gonna make you eat some soup that you hate. But it's good for you. I thought it would be a mushroom I thought it'd be some I thought it would be normal max soup, but no. You had to be difficult, Urshifu. How dare you make me search for this Pokemon? The soothing wetlands. Okay, let's see. Head to the hop for hop those wink where you check on the map. I have to go to the forest to focus. Gotcha. It's a Fletchlinda. To the forest of focus. I was thinking it could be a comfy. Finally, Mason, I've been waiting forever for you. I thought Glenwood Tangle was a real maze, but this place is on an entirely different level. It is. It's and so it's so hot and humid that I'm sweating a pond over here. Sonia and I split up places to survey, and she opted for the cold and snow after all. Too bad we can't and somehow divide the heat up between us two. We'd both feel a bit better. Anyway, I was checking out the sports to focus. Place where I was waiting for you to show up. And there's some signs of Lilligant and Appalin live here. Maybe we can gather up a bit of sweet nectar that Urshifu should love from the flowers and fruit. So what are you saying? Are you saying we find a we have to find a lilligan? There's a pel there's a petal. Tiddly. That's a petal. It's pre-evolution. Look, it's a petal. Petal evolved into lilligan, which is just the Pokemon we're looking for. Pet. Hey, that doesn't that pedal look seem to be acting a bit strange? It looks a bit lost. Yeah, now that you mention it, it's still pretty little. Maybe it's got separated from its parents. Aw, it's walking up to you. Tilly, Tilly. Whoa. Oh, you're glooming onto me. You must be lost if you think I'm your mum. And now I'm stuck. Okay. You've got to help us here, out here, Mason. Go find us one of Pelelu's parents or something, would you? Look, look for someone in home worried looking Lilligant. I'll be wait, I'll wait, I'll wait here with this little one. I'm afraid I'll step on it if I start walking around. Gosh. Mm. God dang it, Hop. Urshifu, come on. We're looking for a Lilligant. Oh, Lilligant. Oh, Lilligant. Oh, please show up so I won't take forever to do this. That's. That, that, that. Oh, Sculpid. That's a Sculpid. Oh, Pikachu right there. Make my way downtown while drop while uh, pedaling fast. Gonna try to find a little li 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 and a little again. Saying to it, I don't know. I, I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to be. I'm trying to be funny, okay, guys. There's the little again. Lil, Lilligant, are you looking for some someone, buddy, or lady? 
Come on, let's, let's interact with it after I uh, scatter this item. Another twig, damn it! Lele? Do we lost a pedalo? Lele again! Lele wants to follow you. Follow me, see? We're gonna avoid the scallopede. The scallopede in, the, in this, this Sierra Woods. We're avoiding the Passaminion. Ah, oh, gosh! That's a Moongus! Little again. Uh, there's Hop. There you go, Hop. Did, did. Oh my gosh. Did Little again fall behind? Where'd you go, Little again? Little again's all the way over there. I'm right here. Catch up to me, will ya? Come on, Lilligant! Hurry up. Don't tell me I have to walk. Follow me. We have to be slow, cause you and your teeny tiny little legs are too slow for your own good. This is a awesome moment right here. Finally, Mason, and you found Lilligant. Lily! Lily! Eh, looks like they're both pretty happy to see each other. Kintu! Think, 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 Mason. I'd say Lilligant's trying to thank you. Lily! Is that some of the nectar from your flower, Lilligan? Got to. Now that's wholesome right there. See ya, Pedalil. See ya, Lilligan. Nice one, Mason. Now we've got to find some of Lilligan's nectar. Hopefully this nectar is sweet and sticky, just like Urshifu likes it. Hmm, I definitely wouldn't call it very sticky. It's pretty watery. I don't think, think this is what you need, mate. But at least we did it a good deed anyway. Come on, let's give Appalin nectar a try next. Why don't we combine an Appalin's nectar with that? Now that seems like a good idea. Appalin nectar mixed with Lilligans. It's probably the perfect thing. Come on, Hop. Where the heck did you go, Mr. Miss Earth to Mr. Hop? Hyper Potion. Oh, God. Oh, gosh. Pokemon. Stop popping out of nowhere. It's like rude. App. It's an app. We found an app, a Pokemon app. Not Pokemon Go, but it's a Pokemon apple in. Pen pineapple, apple pen. Apple apple in. There, it's an apple in. Tap away. Now, th now it's running away from you, Hop. You scared it. Applin, no, wait. We, we just want some nectar. Oh my me. This is rotten. I don't see that Applin anywhere. 
I'm sure what you're rolling off this way. Mason, we've got to find that apple. It's in the. I bet it's in this tree. It's in this tree, I bet. Huh? Is something wrong with that berry tree? Ouch! The apple in clocked you right in the head. Ow! How dare you bonk me on the head? Apple even! Oh, it ran off again. Huh? Oh, Mason. Is your head feeling a bit moist? That's gotta be Apple's nectar on you. I might have given up of, of the slip, but at least we're able to get what we came for. But is Apple and Spectre sweet enough for Urshifu? Well, like, like, like they say, the proof is in the pudding, or the Apple. So let's give it a try. Slurp. Hmm. I don't think you describe it as sticky as exactly. It's more like a juice or something. Relicant Nectar wasn't it. Apple and Nectar wasn't it. They weren't really sticky enough to be sticky honey that Urshifu loves. Exactly Come to think of it, they aren't really honey at all, are they? I was thinking nectar and honey were the same thing. I don't see one of those every day. It's cute looking, right? But it can't produce a really thick gooey poison inside its body, making its prey pretty dangerous. Don't tell me! Th that's it? I was stuck on the Pokemon that produces nectar. But what we really need is a Pokemon that uses that sort of nectar to produce something else. Something like honey! Yes. Bravo, Mason. Bravo. And when it comes to Pokemon that collect and stores lots of nectar and to make honey. Well, the answer is obvious, right? It's a combi. Beehive Pokemon! The Beehive Pokemon has got to be the answer, I'm sure of it this time. The Invespa Queen is the Beehive Pokemon, right? Mason, have you ever seen one? Not in this game, I have. I have not seen a Vespa Queen in this game. Seen in Legends Arc is seen it in other in a Pokemon my first playthrough of Pokemon Diamond, the DS version. Seen it in the anime too. If we're talking about the Isle of Armor, I think we should find in some of on the island shaped like a honeycomb over near that big blue tower. Now that we know what we're looking for going, I'm off. Don't m make me wait, Mason. Holy cow! We evolved our cup boo. Now we have to go to the Tower of Water, I think, again? Find Vespa Queen on the hexagonal island. We'll go to the town map and see it. It's right here. That means we have to go fly off around the training lowlands? Going to training lowland. Because we have to get to the hexagonal island that way. Is that. Wigglytuffs are here. Isn't Wigglytuff a tank? And it's foggy in this area. <gasps> Azumarill! That's what I'm planning on getting. I, 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 I love Azumarill. You should guys should know this. I have one in my team. I have one in my team. In Pokemon Brilliant Diamond, and I need to catch it for that reason. I'm gonna do the surging strikes. Everybody, Dougie!
I had to catch it. Because Uzumarill is one of my favorite Pokemon. To the hexagonal island. After I get this. Boom. Found Calm Mine over here. Taking, we're going to the Challenge Beach. Hexagonal Islands this way. And to think it would be only a 40, uh, 30 minute stream, but it ends up being a 40 minute. How you doing, Lilligant? Buzz, buzz, boy. I've seen loads of Combi around, but no sign of Vespa Queen so far. But they're the only ones that have very sticky honey. Huh, I borrowed a power spot detector from Sonia, but why is it going off now? Don't tell me! Is it reacting to this tree here? Don't you bloody tell me that the Vespa Queen is in that tree. Something's got to be up, Mason. I think we should check it out now. Hell. Will you shake thy tree? Come down, ya boy. In this case, girl. Vern. What has happened now? Oh, we're about to get attacked. Beep 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 beep. Yeah! Oh, beehive! Whatever it is that came from the tree sucks you into the Pokemon Den. And it's Gigantamax Vespa Queen. Airstream on it.
Before I forget to grab that. We're gonna beat this thing. Can you help me evolve a Rhydon? I was supposed to, to use in a beat Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl. It's on Switch now. I could probably do that in Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl, right? but not this minute. Maybe after I'm done recording, hang a Ur Ezra, the first Lion and Keyblade Master. I'm gonna call you a Keyblade Aid for short. Do you have the uh, peaceful? Do you have the protector for your Rye Dawn? That's a. Uh, a shiny Rye Dawn. Yeah, I can do that. Right after I beat. After I beat. Uh, at the end of the stream. Or before I should. Let's say I'll join, connect it. I'll give you a random that I have uh, for the trade. But do you have a? Uh, as I said though, do you have the protector item? Because the protector item. Okay, you bought it this morning. That's all I need to know because the protector item needs to be held to get the right carrier. Want to make sure to be clear? After I finish streaming, and and I, and you can't use Discord. Okay, it's all good. You don't need to use Discord. It's all good. I just gotta need to write down on what your. I just gotta make sure for when I do make a. For when I connect to you, when we do the stream, I. He, uh, well, you know. I'd appreciate it if you do set up that, that so I could uh, write this that down for me to connect to you. If that makes any sense? I do not mind uh, helping out a fellow player on Sword and Shield. I can, uh, yeah, I can do it right now if you, real quick, if you need be. I just know what I have to, uh, do. I ain't gonna use Urshifu for this fight. I'm gonna first use my Cinder, I'm gonna use my Cinderace, I'm gonna... This is my main team, and uh, feel free to get ready for the trade. I'll help you to evolve that Rhyperior. I don't want to go into random trade and trade away a Link Evolution 
I learned that the hard way on Violet. Uh, I have not, I've yet to do that, but... Okay, we're gonna go turn on the internet on this. Give me a moment. We're gonna turn on, we're gonna connect to it. We're already, I'm already connected to the game or the internet already, so there's that. Connecting, please stand by. Yeah. Okay, uh, give me a moment. I'm gonna uh, be right back. Put on my normal game. Him so I could go onto it. Ooh, shiny Gengar. There we go. I got on my account that is connected to Nintendo. So that way... Hey, yeah, I could trade because obvious reasons. This is my main... This is my main game that I've completed from when the game came out. Now we're going to connect to the internet, and you shall get your wish of a shine. get yourself a shiny Rhyperia. And wait for it, it's connecting, and now we're connected. We're going to do a link trade. I'll set a link code, okay? And this one will be simple, okay? Hey, Nick Masons, how you doing? I made a random trade code. And Ezra, I'm waiting for your trade link. Is your okay, Ezra? Is that you? Who your gyro? Your dinoid, right? I'll give you one of my. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. I'll give you a. Uh, I'm trying to think of something easy that I could easily replace. I could easily probably replace. I could easily replace Diglett. I'm only choosing. I only chose Diglett because it's easy to replace, and I'll on a course we'll give back your shiny. Don't worry. Now I get this in my Pokedex.
There you go. I got that in my Pokedex. I will, I'll take your League card as well. And now I'll trade back your... They trade this back. Here you go, here's your Rhyperior. Uh, thank you, uh, Ezra. If you ever want to see me on streams, I, am pra I practically stream almost every single day. Namely, the Nintendo version, Nintendo games. I'm going to save data in case, and now we're going to go back into uh, finishing up my uh, Pokemon Hana and Isle of Armor DLC on my other account. I'm going to be right back and join that back up. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna try defeating this thing with my Cinderace. Cinderace is my main bro. He should be plenty effective against this Vespa Queen. Open says me, Vespa Queen. Beep, 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 beep. Blah blah blah. Dynamax sequence commences. I like how it says, oh, beehive. Or behave. But not in a typical way. Queen a bug flying or just pure bug? If it's a bug flying, I have good super effectiveness. Holy Jesus. That was a crit. Was even a that was even better. <laughs> to myself, that yeah. of a battle caused a strange comb of honey to fall from the b above. Comb of max honey, you put the in the medicine pocket. It also has the same effect as Max Revive. Honey that uh, Dynamax Vespa Queen produce. Adding this honey to Max Soup makes the taste very smooth. It also has the same effect as a Max Revive. I sure wasn't expecting a Dynamax Vespa Queen. 
it to come swooping out to attack us. I was too shocked to even think of joining you in the battle. Yeah, it's okay, bro. There is some seriously sticky honey. I'm sure it's the certain something Urshifu loves. And it seems like the honey was setting off my power spot detector too. The max mushrooms and this honey you can find here on the Isle of Armor. They both seem to have some kind of tie to Dynamaxing and Gigantamaxing. There's tons we don't yet know about it. There's tons of research just waiting to be done. Come on, you've got the thing you were looking for, so let's head back to the dojo at once. Oh, I got a medium candy from here, too. Joe Smith, welcome to the stream. Uh, hey, how many diglets do you ha have? I have no clue. I have... I really don't have any clue. I don't... All I know is I find them as I go. No, get... Ah, oh, come on. I've yet to get any of the dig- I have yet to find any more. Oh, and I just got another subscriber? Oh, thank you. Thank you, uh, Joe Smith, for subscribing. If you ever want to be notified, hey, just make sure to turn on the notification bell. <laughs> I hope you enjoy. If you ever want to see how this uh, Galar region adventure started, there's a playlist down below if you want to check it out. There's also my Let's Go Eevee playthrough that you can check out that one too. And eventually, I'm gonna finish off Brilliant Diamond. It was around Christmas when I decided to do individual games instead of doing once every other day, hey, you know? Like a rotation of some kind. Fly back to the dojo and finish our DLC, hopefully. Ever played Pikmin? I actually never played Pikmin, surprisingly enough. And I've only just recently started playing Animal Crossing New Horizons. Did that play through a little bit of Twitch. I have yet to pick it back up by on uh, streaming, but not on, on YouTube. Maybe I'll do events and such on uh, Animal Crossing New Horizons. And that was my first game I've ever played for it. I'm also doing Super Mario Sunshine as well. And eventually, if I do get the Game Boy Advance, I might need to play Super Mario... Oh, not Super Mario. Um, Mario Luigi Superstar Saga. And I forgot to say Mustard's voice. <laughs> oh, and that is the sweet scent I detect. Wafting through the air around you. Heh <laughs> That'd be the max honey that Urshifu loves to um the max. We got our hands on it on a nice haul of it. Did you now already? 
You'll put me and Mason on it, old man. There's nothing the two of us can do can't do together. Her her her! You did a real bang up job finding that Max honey, but hardly a hint for me. Very nicely done, Mason. And our little hop too. I like doing these voices, because they're funny. You see. You didn't forget for a second what that certain something was, did you? If we add Max Honey to our Max Soup, even Urshifu will be sure to want a sip. Urfu! Right? Been real, Mason. But I think you've just learned about everything. The Master Jojo has to teach you. Which that which means that you and I can finally have a proper battle. But absolutely no holding back. I could use a bit of training if I'm going to be ready for what's to come after all. I won't be pulling any punches this time, kiddo. If you think you're really ready for me when I'm serious, then come to the battle court out back. Oh my gosh. Now I have to fight him. For that, I'm going to need to use my main party. Not only the master when he's serious. That's seriously terrifying. He's the one who taught Lee, after all. So Mustard's got to be one wicked strong trainer. I just like how his name is Mustard, after all. Of course he is. Steal your opponent here. Steal your spirit for battle, Mason. I guess I'd better start getting serious about this research I came here to do, too. Good luck with your things, things, Mason. I'm sure you'll manage, like you always do. I'll come dashing right up back to catch that battle, though. If you do try taking on Master Mustard... Yeah, we're gonna take out Master Mustard. After all the dang training I've done. I have an idea. It might be crazy, but it might just work. Okay, let's check out our team's moves real quick. Check summary. Yes, Toxic Spikes. We'll use that. Start with Toxic Spikes out in the battle. That way, he he will have a take a serious punch. You know what I mean? Are you ready for another battle with little old me? Yes. <laughs> That's what I would like want to hear. Then let's mosey on over to the battleground. Let's go, Mason. 
Dun, 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 dun. I have to rename some of these episodes because I forgot which type of number there was before. Yeah, change. Not, I have to change one from nine, eight, one of the 18s to a 19 and then turn the 19 to a 20. You know, I've been thinking more and more these days about how fortunate we were to have you join the JoJo. Even if it was by mistake at first. I can't thank you enough, Mason. It's been a while since I've been so excited. I can feel my blood burning and my heart just dancing with anticipation. I don't know if I'll live after this battle. I just can't resist a battle against a worthy opponent, no matter how old I get. Now then, let's get these things going. This is the most fun time in the world. He's in a serious mode. Old man mustard. In his full party. It's been a while since I faced such a strong opponent. My blood's boiling over. Time to see exactly what all the training has made of you. Hopefully I get the first move. No, I don't got the first move. Oh, the blaze kick! Of course he gets me with a blaze kick. For that, he will die in a fire. Corviknight, kick its butt. Use Drill Peck. Aha! I see we got the fundamental down pat. I won't alone won't cut it. Level sixty nine. Luxray. Let's see. I'll send out Toxtricity. He's the only one I got that could basically negate damage, so to speak. Since it's part electric. Of course, he has the Intimidate ability. And I got the Punk Rock ability. And for that, I'm going to use a Toxic. To poison him. What the heck? Psychic Fangs? We go with a Poison Jab attack. Hopefully I can outspeed him with a mega kick. Wild Charge just killed him. Lycanroc. 
Both Riken Rocks are water type. Not water type, rock type. Dreadnought will be the best option. For that liquidation. like I'm gonna have to he have to use a it's either Corviknight or Eevee. More than likely a Corviknight. Corviknight, you're gonna be a meat shield for a bit. Race, if you can outspeed him, I'll be happy. Outspeed it. Out. I was hoping it would outspeed it. Cinderace, you, you should be able to outspeed him. One that I could that really would do damage that's a, to a kimono would be my dreadnought. Maybe 
Maybe I can bounce? Hopefully I can land a Paralyze. That was super effective. This is his last Pokemon. Is there, he has an Earth. He evolved his Kapu. One more hit, then he is done. One more. And of course I get one shot. Incendiary's faints. Eevee's the only one left. One little Eevee. I don't use Eevee that often. I'll take out Corviknight just so he could... go with a drill peck. I'm at 1 HP! Come on, Corviknight. You can do this, bud. You can do this, bud. Let's go! We just finished this. The power of heal stalling. Strength ebbs and flows. Well, I've learned to grasp it. And it next it slips from your hand. But the strength you know I'll have, the strength that you'll let you, you defeat me, it is unwavering. Congratulations from the bottom of my heart. Give me a 30,000 polka dollars. For 
ha ha ha! I held absolutely nothing back, and yet you still defeated me! The apprentice surpasses his master. A true moment of pride for the master. You deserve a very special league card for me. It seems I will have to redo my own training from scratch. Oh, darling, did I hear right? You actually lost. Ah, so you all came. You know I can't resist seeing you get all serious about battle, you cheeky thing. You took... you look utterly dashing, darling. Oh, but look at... look at me getting all distracted. You were amazing, Mason. Looks like we all need to have some axe soup tonight to celebrate! I knew you weren't just a new student. I think I'll call you Master Newbie from now on. Master Newbie. I ain't getting that let down, am I? Well, I'm not surprised one bit. Mason, I knew you'd win. Um... Um, Mason. I, I just... well... I guess, should, I guess I should congratulate you. But I won't. Why should I celebrate anything you do, huh? Still, that cleared up a lot. You're strong enough to beat the master going all out. I never stood a chance. But the next time I face you... I'll take you on fair and square, and I won't lose, you'll see. I don't think you I'll lose. Ah, you're downright infuriating. You know that. Almost as bad as I am. Well, at least... Went the correction. Mm -mm. Well, at least she's aware of her own flaws. Well, that wraps up the last of the training here at the Master Dojo. Oh, back to normal, huh, Master? Mason! I hope you'll come by and have more battles with me from time to time. It'll make us both stronger. Just so we're ready for when the time comes. Hehehe, <laughs> don't worry. You'll find out what I'm talking about eventually. Anyway, let's all head back, shall we? Like one big family. Yeah! As the, as the screen cuts to black. And that's the end of Isle of Armor Adventures. I can't believe you beat the master, even when he was serious. Mason, you might be able to tackle this dojo's most grueling type of training ever. Restricted sparring. If you have the courage to try it, let me know. Beep, beep, beep. Mason, at last. Hello, hello. There, this is Mason's Rotom phone, right? Yes. Brilliant. I asked Hop for your number. I'm glad he didn't pull anything funny, like giving me the wrong Oh, sorry. Guess I should have said who was calling you, eh? It's me, Leon. So, if I look, took you aback, but rest assured, there can only be a pretty good reason for me to call you out of the blue. Like this. The former champion of Galar has a favor to ask of the current champion. And that it's you, Mason. Come on over to Wyden Stadium, and I'll tell you all the details. I'll head that way myself now, and I swear I won't take any detours or get lost. Do I have to go to Wyden Stadium? I don't think I will. But just so I... Screw this up. I'm saving this data. And I hope you guys enjoyed my Galar region adventure. 
We finally beat Sword and Shield, Sword, Pokemon Swords, DLC, Isle of Armor. Er, and previously, the Crown Tundra. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hey, this Galar Region adventure. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Follow me on Twitch. Link's in the description down below. And if you want to see this Galar Region all from the beginning, there's a playlist down below for you to click. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. And we're continuing our brilliant diamond story. Peace out, everybody. And goodbye.